Replacing the exhaust blower on an Enviro Empress freestanding pellet stove. The blower will be located in the rear of the stove on this left hand side panel. There are five Torx 20 screws which you'll need to just loosen and the panel will come off. For the sake of this video, we're going to remove all of the panels so you can see what's going on. So this left side panel has the same number of screws, loosen them up and it will come off. On older stoves, take note of this screw. The screw may hold the control board on and you may have to take the control board out. Loosen the top two screws on the rear panel and then locate the bottom mounting screws which are underneath the unit on each side. You may need a longer driver to get underneath the stove. Just loosen that up and it lifts and comes off the screw. Do the same for the other side. With all the screws loose now, we can lift on the rear panel just like so and it will come right off. Now everything inside the mechanical cabinet is exposed. Our combustion blower is going to be held in with six screws. We're just going to loosen these screws and then the motor will slightly turn and come off with a removable hub, just like so. It's important to make note of these screws that they don't come out and you lose them. They're not held in but with very long threads. And we'll just put that back in and just slightly tighten it. This is our low limit switch. You usually don't have to replace this. It's glued to the housing. Locate the wires for the motor. The blue and the white will be how you disconnect and reconnect the motor. Put in your new motor and then slightly tighten up all of the screws so that it's snug. Put your panels back on and we're done.